away. Got the finishing touches done to my Halloween tree. Halloween tree? This ain't no nightmare before Christmas. Squidward, you gotta make up your mind. You can't have two in one. You told me you don't even celebrate Christmas. You told me you celebrate Hanukkah. Nope, I always have the worst luck on holidays. You ruined my last one. Ah, my eyes. Oh, ho, ho. Here, you want some real candy? Get off my lawn. Open up your Halloween basket. Catch. I need presents too, SpongeBob. I don't get none of them on Hanukkah. Instead of Santa Claus for Hanukkah last year, I had a hobo in a trash can guided by donkeys show up to my lawn. Besides, if I celebrate on Christmas, then I gotta deal with the Grinch coming in, getting his muddy feet to steal my stuff. Grinch doesn't play by Santa's rules, SpongeBob. I saw him in a Toyota Prius coming in to steal my presents. I got my costume on. How do people even dress like this? My butt itches. This is so tight. Imagine wearing this every day. Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, sorry. I had to collect myself there. That's the scariest Halloween custom I've ever seen. You're wearing the clothes of an absolute psychopath, Patrick. Oh, this is only the second scariest costume I could have come up with. The first one I came up with was you, Squidward. But, of course, you don't wear any pants. I took off my pants to dress as you, and I got arrested for indecent exposure. Well, look at SpongeBob over here. He's got a dumb pumpkin on his head. How do you even see with that thing on, huh? What do you mean, Squidward? I can see you just fine. <laughs> at least this way, I can't really see your ugly mug. Nah, Squidward, I think you're decorating the real scary thing here. I bet you don't even own a pumpkin, Squidward. <laughs> well, joke's on you. I just picked this up at the farmer's market this morning. <laughs> What the heck kind of pumpkin is that? I hope you got this on the bargain sale because, oh, uh, why is it so crusty? Uh, it doesn't even stand up right. It keeps falling over on your dumb tree. Since it doesn't stand up, you're supposed to carve it right here? Dang, Squidward, you're decorating like an old person, bro. What the heck are those? <laughs> I see these all the time and I don't even know the names of them. Who the heck actually buys these things? I mean, come on, they're fruit, right? Are they really only good for decorating? Who decorates using fruit? Yeah, what the heck are these? I've never seen them before in my life. Like that one. What is it? Badger, get the heck away from my house. That's not a fruit. That's a decorative piece of art. <laughs> oh, yeah. Some fresh pineapple. In this thing, it looks like a bootleg pumpkin. Why is it called spaghetti oh, squash? All right, let's see why they call this thing a spaghetti oh, squash. Oh. It's actually full of spaghetti. <laughs> Darn it. Why couldn't it have been a ravioli squash? Seriously, Squidward, you got all this junk and you're telling me you don't even got a cornucopia to put it in? Or an actual pumpkin? It's not like I grow it myself. I just bought it from the store. What the heck do you want from me? What do you want from me? Shame on you, Squidward. You could have asked me. I got these special pumpkin seeds right here. Yep, these are all it takes to grow a pumpkin. Did they come out of your pumpkin head? All right, Squidward, watch a master. Watch a pro. All right, just plant this in right here. Look, it's already sprouting. Just give it a minute. And you got a pumpkin. Oh, so that's what pumpkin seeds look like. So these must be some banana seeds. No, Patrick, what the heck are you talking about? Those are obviously baby bananas. See, it says baby right there. No, you got it all wrong, Squidward. That's just the baby's Discord handle. Yeah, I added him last week. He wanted my social security, so I sent him in. Where the heck did you get those things anyway? Uh, don't worry about it. Squidward, you really got a kiwi? Aren't those extinct? Look, I'm dissecting my own head. Huh, I knew I was qualified for brain surgery. Why did I get a job at the Krusty Krab? I could have been making millions. All right, here we go. You know, you don't really got to be too fragile on these sort of things. All that hard work of growing this pumpkin's paying off. See this beauty? Ugh. Oh, yeah. Look at those guts. I just got to remove the guts. Oh, pretty gory. Oh, it looks like we're not done. It's really like cooking a turkey. Ugh. Ugh. Of course, you got to debone it. Yep. Got to get that whole skeleton out. Ah, man, that blows a museum. 
got the boneless pumpkin. You don't want to be crunching on some pumpkin pie and breaking your tooth on a bone now, do you? All right, and the cake's finally done too. Man, we're getting good progress out. All right, just got to put the final decorative spider on there. Ugh. Man, I'm so glad it's done. It turned out so well. That took forever to me. Halloween party's gonna be crazy. Oh, hey, SpongeBob. Something smells good. Is, is that... What the heck is Spider! You? Spider! 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 Patrick, my main man, what's up? Oh, that's an actual real spider. Get that thing the heck out of here. You ready to get some street tacos later, Patrick? My of dog. course, dog. I'll do anything with you. Man, Patrick, you're absolutely filthy. You're looking like a straight left for dead zombie with that dumb shirt on. Dang, Patrick, why is it the man bones in here? You got that fur? Either that or it's the bone cancer. Yeah, yeah. I'm supposed to be an unemployed bum. You should address this yourself, then, you unemployed bum. Hey, I heard someone hated spiders around here, huh? Can't be having that, dude. Holy, it's the real Spider-Man. Wait, what the heck are you supposed to be? Are you dressing up as yourself or something? Well, a new diet pill came out, so, you know, I got that perfect figure. I had a lot of imposters dressing up on me. I had to beat them up, but I thought it'd be too obvious if I went as my normal self, so went ahead and got this nice blade. Check it out. You know, I chop a couple fingers off when I get some disgusting candy. I ain't eating that. I want some Charleston Chews or some Hershey's or maybe some full bars out here. Here, you want to see how I've been getting absolutely scammed? I've been getting absolute garbage out here. Check this out. I got these jelly bellies and some of them are just disgusting. How do I know if I'm going to bite into one if it's not going to be booger flavored or, or vomit flavored? Or how to eat fried worms flavored. I can't be taking that risk. Pencil shaving. Or real baked beans. Or, or troll bogies. Ugh, troll bogies. Why do they say bogies? It's boogies. If I'm going to play Russian roulette, I might as well get a loaded gun and spin the wheel and try to shoot myself in the head. Come on, man. Oh, and look, someone made a complete mockery of me. My arch enemy's venom is on the cover. And look, creepy crawlies and it's worms. What about spiders? Well, not to brag or anything, but I'm kind of loaded. Who knew dressing up as a homeless bum made people think I'm actually homeless? I've been getting the good stuff. Oh, hold on one second. I just gotta test out my new web shooter. Oh, uh, yeah, it's been my functioning lately. Huh, yeah, it seems ah! to be working pretty good. Ooh, my candy! Yeah, that's some nice candy. <laughs> something there, something over here. Dang! Web throw! No, I'm not done testing. I'm not done testing. Oh, <laughs> ah! Dang! Alright, I was just about to give you some candy for trick-or-treating, but if you're gonna throw some webs in my face... Oh, no, 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 wait. Sorry, that was just a malfunction of my web shooter. Oh, did you, did you say candy? It better not be disgusting. Oh, it's disgusting, alright. I mean, no, no, it's delicious. Wait till Spider-Man breaks one of his teeth on one of these. Grandma candy. You'd only find an expired jar of these in your grandma's attic. <laughs> All right, Spider-Man, open your basket, trick or treat. Oh, you try to break my teeth, man? And <laughs> I don't even got any fingers for you to chop off. Well, no, but you got a big nose I can chop off. Wait, 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 no! <laughs> Dang it, my candy's completely ruined. I'm gonna have to go into my candy reserves. That's right, my favorite candy, it's M&M's. This is from last year, SpongeBob. Oh boy, let's see what you got, Patrick. All right, got the dark chocolate M&M's, a classic. classic. Pretzel M&M's, orange m and on there, crunchy. Caramel, hmm, well, not personally a fan of it, but yellow M&M, classic. classic. Huh. Weird that he's splitting open one of his own kind now. 
That's kind of morbid. Uh, almond blue. All right. You know, it's an alternative to peanuts, so I'll give them that. Of All right. What's next? What? Oh, peanut. Of course. Yeah. Peanut's always good. Yellow M&M on there. Weird that he's got two. Classic. Okay. Peanut butter. That could be good. Classic. Red M&M again, though. Second time we've seen him. All right, milk chocolate minis. All right, the mini ones. So you don't choke, they melt faster. Uh, why is it red again? Uh, and the small pack. What, why is it always red? Are you kidding me? You don't even have the green M&M. Before red? Why does it need so many? How stingy is he? You're telling me they couldn't even make a pink M&M? And they use red this many times? <laughs> SpongeBob, it sounds like you want some Skittles. They got a purple one in there. Okay, what the heck is that? Ah, uh, it's not important. I can't believe you're wearing nothing for Halloween, and you even got the cap repping for Halloween. Halloween crunch? Whew. Ghost turned milk green. It's like that green chocolate milk. That'll make Hulk proud. Even that dumb tricks rabbit with the spirit of Halloween and bought a $2 wig for a dead movie. You didn't even have to spend a ton of money for a Halloween costume. Look, all you gotta do is bust out the scissors and you could have had that dumb hair too. Yeah, well, are you sure you wanna bust out the products to try and expose me? Take a look at this. After all the years of being on the cover of Gogurt, they replaced you with some generic Halloween character. No, it can't be true. No. What's up, dudes? I'm back. I got a new Halloween costume. That's right. I got into legal trouble for chopping people's fingers off, but I'm back. <clears throat> Look right here. I got my own Spider-Man Gogur. That's right. You got replaced, but I'm still being repped. Anyways, I decided to turn those fingers that I cut off into candy. I still got a bunch left. Do you want one? <clears throat> Man, the heck? What did he leave behind? Spider-Man left behind this disgusting candy. So this is what he was giving out, huh? What the heck kind of webs are these? How can he fight crime with these? These are like clouds. What? And they dissolve in water? Man, what the heck? Wait, dude, I'm Spider-Man's arch enemy. You're telling me I could've used water to dissolve his webs this whole time? Darn it! Oh. <laughs> A booster bundle. This, this is better than candy. How have I not heard of this before? I opened all of these, all of these, and I got this many duplicates. Ah! Ah! <laughs> You're telling me all I had to do was give SpongeBob some duplicate Pokemon cards and he would have died so I could have stole his outfit and spending $250 on this one? Darn it! Oh, hey, Patrick, you changed. Yeah, I was tired of looking absolutely filthy. People kept getting out their shotgun instead of candy, thinking I was a real homeless person. But ever since I changed my outfit, I went back trick-or-treating and look what someone gave me. Dang, this thing's shaped like a coffin. Is it even legal to give someone this thing? The One Chip Challenge 2022. Why do they keep breeding peppers to be hotter and hotter? They're already hot enough. One supercharged pepper shocked the senses. Oh, Patrick, I think that's a horrible idea. Get a straight jolt to the gut. That thing's straight up black. Dang, that thing looks like death, Patrick. No wonder it comes in a coffin. Well, it came in your trick-or-treat basket, so go ahead and take a bite. Uh, I have no choice, SpongeBob. Whew. My face would like for death. You gotta take life by the hands and just... If I charge, follow me. If I retreat, kill me. If I die, avenge me. Patrick, you're, you're at Disneyland. Everything that I've done has led me to this point. I'm bad, and that's good. I will never be good at that. Well, Spongebob, I gotta give the devil my blessing anyway. He's gonna be wanting to take me after this. All right, here goes nothing. Whose bag of Doritos is this?
Oh, hey, it's got Venom on the cover. Oh, yeah, Squidward left his bag of Doritos over here. I don't know why. Oh, I'm not eating this thing. The Halloween spirit finally died inside of you, Patrick, huh? Decided to change it to your normal self? <laughs> I knew you wouldn't last. I was wondering why I left this. Ah, nothing like some good old Doritos with Venom on the cover. What? Why is this one black? Whew, those baking glasses paint off. Man, they look absolutely devilish. These are gonna win the contest for sure. You know what, I'm done baking. Patrick wants to destroy my stupid cake. I'm just gonna give him some store-bought cupcakes then. Yeah, apparently Patrick likes destroyed food, so I don't even care if some of them tipped over. You know what, for extra measure, I think I'll just cha-cha-cha. cha cha dee cha dee cha Baked fresh, man, they smell amazing. Oh, hey, Squidward, you baked some cupcakes? Well, I'm submitting mine for the contest right here. I'm sure they'll win. <laughs> what the heck is that? You call those cupcakes? Uh, mind if I take a gander? Oh no, be my guest. Check them out. <laughs> Did you hit a couple bumps on the right home, SpongeBob? First of all, these are store bought, but second off, they look disgusting. Oh no, nah, it's nothing that can't be fixed. You know, just cut, grab a couple sprinkles and put them on there, and uh, just good as new. I'll, I'll, you know, it's all mushed together. I'll just call it a cake. How about that? I'm sure they'll be yours. Yeah. Oh, mateys, I'll be the judge of this Halloween baking contest today. All right, let's take a look at the competition. Oh, well, what the heck happened there? Uh, all right, so you got some cupcakes, I see. All right, well, I think I know who won. It's Patrick, obviously. I mean, look at that house. He's homeless, come on. Have some sympathy. Gotta have somewhere to live. What the heck? The roof isn't even on. <laughs> Fifteen.